Hello friends, welcome to my learnings online. Today we are going to discuss about AWS free tier account. So first of all, what is AWS free tier account? The AWS free tier enables you to gain free hands-on experience with a AWS platform products and services. Now, who should have free tier account? Everyone who belongs or want to belong to AWS should have AWS free tier account. Anybody can have free tier account, whether he is a student, he is an entrepreneur, or it is a company or it is an organization. Anybody can have free tier account. Next, what we are going to learn in this session. In this session, we are going to learn few facts about AWS free tier account. What are the prerequisites for creating free tier account? How to create a free tier account? Okay, few facts are like it's free for first one year, means for 12 consecutive months we can use free tier account without providing any charge if we use it within the provided quota or within the provided limited. Second is free quota is provided on month basis like we get a quota for first month we get quota for second month third month and so on we cannot carry forward quota of one month in next month suppose we get quota of 10 hours for one service if we don't use that 10 hours we cannot carry forward the remaining quota within next month okay so we have to use the quota within same month in which it is provided next we can use any service in any region in any availability zone once we are using AWS free tier account in case we exceed the provided free tier limits then we are charged on standard rates whatever the standard rates for a service we are charged for it so please always take care of whether we are crossing free tier limits or not we should always be in free tier limits okay and one more thing uh, we get 750 hours per month for windows machine plus 750 hours of free usage for linux machine means we can run two parallel machines at the same time for the whole year okay so we should get a full benefit of this facility next so what are the prerequisites for creating a free tier account we should have a valid and work email id second one valid debit or credit card so now we are going to create a free tier account let me show you a demo the site for creating free tier account is https colon slash slash aws dot amazon dot com slash free in case you don't remember this site just go to google dot com press aws free tier account and press enter the very first link you will get for creating a free tier account just click on it next create a free tier account here it will ask for a valid email address so uh, we have a very uh, valid, valid email address is my learnings online lab1 at the rate gmail.com we need to give a password we need to confirm password now we need to give a name to this AWS account we can give any name to this AWS free tier account for now we are giving this account with uh, my learnings 
ऑनलाइन क्लिक कंटिन्यू when we click continue it will ask for further details it will ask whether we are using it professionally or personally trust me it doesn't matter much we can use a free tier account in any way like as i told in beginning anybody can have a free tier account whether it's an organization whether it's a student or whether it's a trainer or whatever the thing is we should Use free tier account within provided limits only. Okay, so for now let me choose as professional. It doesn't matter anything. Let me choose it professional. And still, if you have any doubt, you can just click on this uh, informational icon and read like select professional. If you intend to use this account within your company, educational institution, or organization, otherwise it doesn't matter anything. Until unless we are using within free tier limits, okay. So company name is My Learnings Online. Phone number I will provide my phone number. Country I select it as India. Here, uh, please make a note when we choose a country. accordingly it will provide me currency in which i need to provide some amount to verify whether i have an valid credit or debit card if i choose here us it will ask in dollars like uh, it will ask for 1 or 2 dollar and if I, uh, uh, if i have provided india it will ask me for 2 rupees it will deduct my 2 rupees in the beginning and after some time it will give it back it is just for verification whether i have a valid debit or credit card okay i will provide my address house number x y z my city is faridabad state is haryana pin code is 121001 i need to click this here i have left phone number intentionally i will add it now and then i will click next i have entered my phone number now i will click create account and continue as soon as i enter my details it will ask me for val uh, valid credit or debit card here i will enter my credit or debit card number here it's expiry dates and its card holder name obviously it's my name <laughs> and uh, for billing address should i need to use my already provided address or i need to provide a new address it's all up to me if i have a valid pan card then i need to click yes if not then no okay so i will provide uh, details and then i will click uh, secure submit let me provide my details just hold for a second i will pause the video to keep it secret to me <laughs> or secure submit it's enter and uh, as soon as it get verified it will show me next screen in the background it is checking for the details please make a note we should give a valid credit or debit card number we should not try a dummy account or like that trust me it is going to validate so i have received a otp let me provide it here it's a 0746 okay i will click submit and see 
it is going to charge two rupees though it will give it back to me after some time but for now it's going to charge two rupees it is showing me indian currency because i selected india as my country in case i would have uh, i have selected us then it would have charged me in dollars so submit and here it is never so again uh, i have entered my phone now i will click this 2 mc 236 here i will ask call me now it will call me now and it will be asking to verify this number like this one i am getting a call let me pick it up so i am entering i have entered it Okay, so I have provided the details. Once done, it will show your identity has been verified successfully. Now we need to click continue. Here, we need to select a plan. In case we don't have a valid reason, please always select basic plan without choosing developer plan or business plan. in developer plan we are charged some money like uh, you can see it's charging dollar 29 and for this plan it is dollar 100 so basically we are we are creating this account for our testing only so i will choose basic plan let's choose free and uh, okay now it is asking for some personal experience but, uh, let me give it um devops okay submit thank you so now my aws free tier account is created so i can sign into console now my id my learnings online lab1 at gmail.com click next it will ask me for password lab okay sign in never Okay now we are done here it is going to sign in and yes it's done you can see my name it's my learning online by default it has opened me on ohio it's us east so here i can see services like this here i can see my billing dashboard obviously it is not going to show me anything because i have not used any service Okay friends here we are done we have created our free tier account hope you have enjoyed this learning session thank you friends please like and share this video to appreciate our efforts also kindly subscribe to encourage me to add more such learning videos thank you thank you very much